hi everyone so it's raining outside and it's early in the morning so um i gotta make a video for one of my friends um i know her from facebook like one day she just added me so i accepted and stuff but um before i started doing videos i would used to take a lot of pictures i still do um of my food dishes um which is one reason why i decided to do um youtube videos because some people would ask me how do you make this how do you make that and you know i can't really write down and explain how i make a certain dish especially you know if it's a little long so that's what inspired me to do youtube videos like some of my cooking for certain people that was asking me for certain recipes so that's like like i said that's why i started doing youtube videos so anyway one particular person i can't i told her i won't mention her name but um um she asked me because i don't have no more facebook that was when i had facebook she added me on facebook now i got instagram so she has me there and she told me like when you're gonna show your kitchen you know <laughs> like as a little joke and stuff like that i was like no because i always got the camera always focused on one particular part which is usually right there when you see the video i'm always right here like i got the camera stand and i put it here so i said i'll give you a little tour around my kitchen now i mean i don't got the best things in life but my kitchen is clean that's all that matters you know as long as my kitchen is clean and i bring out good food out of my kitchen that's all that matters so this is basically a video like of my kitchen so um let's see how this goes all right so i have this over here i wish you could see better but this is like a big stand hold on let me see if i can turn on the light because it's dark here all right you probably can't see it because they're like I mean, even though it's cloudy and it's raining outside but um this is a stand and i got like let me see if i could get a little closer um this is like i bought this and i bought this and i put them on the side i put all of my like my spoons and stuff my utensils and stuff that i use to cook and this right here <clears throat> it only came 10 stuff like 10 um it came with this and it came with like 10 spoons and stuff but since i got a whole bunch of like plastic ones mm -hmm. as well i decided to put all the plastic um like utensils into here for it could just be in one one bunch so that's where that idea came from um this is a sandwich maker this is a crock pot i love it because it's zebra i don't know if you know but i love my zebra prints um this is a uh how you call it a, a waffle maker i just recently bought this and i did a video on chicken and waffles um my son was begging for me to make it so i decided to make the waffles from scratch so that's there this is for when i pick up pots i got bread there because i'm gonna be making um burgers today and i will be making a tutorial on that later on um that's that's a um oh man skip that I, I, i'm right there you know i just woke up and i'm i've still got to pay attention um that's a a toaster that's a can opener oh that's a new wave oven um i use it for whenever i feel like i want to cook healthy you know it takes out all the excess oil of, of the meat it's really really good um in the back of the can opener i have like um you know a mixer to mix cakes and then in the bottom here i have um um oh my goodness i'm sorry it's it's too early like i'll be fuzzy sometimes um i got um my food processor and i got a a ninja of the blender that they be selling on tv so you know when people come over here i do little cocktails and you know how that goes <laughs> and then over there i got my camera stand that's where you know i do my videos and my friend gave me this my friend Shinaren, and she picked it out real good because this my kitchen is red white and black so and i don't know if you noticed but it has this little pattern stuff that is like checker checkerboard like black and white 
she knows me very well um so really the kitchen my kitchen theme is really um um the chef you know the chef theme so i have this there this is very inexpensive this looks like maybe three dollars a piece um i bought three hang them up and it looks really really cute i like it um over here this is my um my my ugh, my sink <laughs> and i have this here because when i clean spoons i like for the water to you know I don't like to just put it where they belong if it's still wet so I let it you know I put it there when it dries up I put it here which we will get there in a few minutes so this is my little cutting board this is my 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 coffee station is what I call it because that's the first thing I'm hitting in the morning you understand my <clears throat> my sugar my folders my cafe bustelo and I have here cappuccino my kids love this one and this is my stove yes nice and clean that's right and I'm just it's not just clean because I'm doing a video it's clean all the time all right and as you can see um I bought this this was a dollar and as you can see I incorporated it with the um with the stove where it could look cute and this is the side of the stove and I don't know if you noticed like like um if you noticed this but I really want to start like probably eating a little healthy and this is like a little motivation that this is the way your plate is supposed to look when you know when you're serving yourself i mean sorry the words is in spanish but you know you got your your rice and beans your chicken your veggies and your and your salad and you know so this is something i have by the stove for just just to give me an idea of how i gotta self-serve myself um, I got here in my refrigerator a whole bunch of gadgets. Um, I don't got no pictures here. These are for pictures. I just recently ordered prints online, you know. So I'm waiting for those pictures to be sent to me. To hang up pictures around my house and, and stuff. But look at how cute. Like I said, red, white, and black. I love it. And these are, you could put pictures in here. These are magnets, whatever. It says, bless our home with love and friends. And I love this sassy and classy shoe queen. Oh my goodness. I love zebra prints. My mother gave me this for a wonderful daughter. And these are the signs of this house. We got Pisces, Virgo, Aries, and Libra. Of course, I'm a Pisces. <laughs> and everything. Um, This is like regular cars. These are like mocha latte cappuccino just showing you everything my friend sharon again <laughs> gave me this for christmas she gave me like a goodie bag with a whole bunch of stuff it's so cute i like it she's like me she always like this is the first friend i ever met that that she always gives me stuff all the time me and hubby stay giving each other stuff like she'll give me stuff and then i'll give her something she gave me stuff and then she gives she's such she's such a sweetheart so um yeah so this is another part of the wall. Like I said, more chef stuff. Um, it's these veggies, pasta, soup. I love it. And then this section over here. This was supposed to be for the living room, like for me to hang out figurines, figuras, um, um, figurines and stuff. But I made it my own because it didn't fit in my, in, not in the kitchen, in the living room. My bad. Um, it was supposed to go for the living room for you to hang up like figurines and stuff. But I made it my own and instead um, I added a popcorn mix, which by the way, I never ever used that. <laughs> I only bought it just for it could look cute and match with my with my with my kitchen because to be honest with you every time I make popcorn I make it in the pot <laughs> I do it old school so uh, but it looks cute maybe one day I'll use it I got some black cups there um sorry I turned off the camera by mistake I pressed the wrong button but what I was saying is that I never used um the popcorn um the popcorn thing right there so I think it's just there for decoration so anyway yeah i got the cups there and i have let me zoom in here um i have those cups there and those cups um 
Somebody gave it to me in a set. It was like a Christmas set. And those were supposed to be like candy cane cups. But, you know, nobody really uses it. You know, me and my family don't use it. So I just decided to put it there, make it look cute, make it go with the kitchen. And I just put my spoons and, and butter knives and forks there. And over here we got, um, oh, plates. But that's when, like, company comes over, you know, like, I'll serve it to them in a plate because we usually have, um, eat here with, um, paper plates. So... Over here is the pantry, which, I, like I said, I'm going to show you in a minute and stuff. Over here, it says here, never trust a skinny chef. Um, no comments on that. I mean, I know a whole bunch of skinny girls that knows how to cook. But then again, the majority of the people that I know, they're like my size. So, <laughs> no comments. Um, what I was going to say is this. I also bought it to match with my chef theme and it's like a um a board and it got the chalk right here now it's funny because i don't even use that either i've never once wrote on it at all and wrote anything that i'm gonna make i just bought it for like to go with the kitchen for decoration like yeah so um my kids wrote on it more than i have so then sometimes i gotta clean it up take a look take a sponge wet the sponge make sure it looks clean and stuff but yeah and over here i have here all the games i still got more in the closet but these are the majority of the games that we play with these are puzzles games um and such so sometime in the weekends if i'm not hanging out um i'll be here playing games with the kids or we'll do puzzles depending on what we decide to do we either watch a movie eat popcorn or we play a game so that's that right here. I had this um in the living room, but the reason why I brought it here is because every time like we wanted to every time we wanted to like to play a game, we never would go to the living room. We always would go to the kitchen and the kitchen is big. And you know, we would play and we, we got I got this table, that's where we'll play at. Um this is a, a little table, not really much, you understand? Um Whenever, like, if if me and my kids do decide to eat together, because usually they'll eat and they'll go to their room because they want to watch TV or whatever. But anyway, but when we do eat together, they'll take some of the chairs that's in the pantry, and then when we finish dinner, then they'll put it back and stuff. But this is just a two two seat chair, I mean table set, and I just bought this to make it look good. And da 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 da. Even though it's a little bended. It's supposed to be flat. My kids be bending it. And like I said, paper plates all the time. And over here, let me show you in the middle right here. I usually have this in case any, you know, like any of my kids eat or I eat or whoever's here eat. <laughs> um, I have here, whether it's pancakes, pancakes or um, whether it's pancakes or breakfast or dinner. I got the syrup right here. I got the sugar right here. This is um to store um napkins, which I don't have no napkins because I have paper towels. And I got here my salt, my pepper, you know, toothpicks. And I got here my tea, you know, just for you could be comfortable and stuff. So that's that section over here. I bought those. I bought those when I was in New York, and I put them on. I brought them with me here in Connecticut. And they were like, I think, 3 or $4 a piece. Um, and it's like Chinese. I like the way I did it. I'm not going to lie. Like with the two in the front, one in the middle, like that. And stuff. And it says love, wisdom, harmony, happiness, and peace. And it was like, I think, 3 $4 a piece. So that's why I usually get mad when people be like, I can't hook up my house. You know, I need money for this. I need money for that. Um, I think it's crap because you could hook up your house with a low budget. <laughs> you just got to try to hook it up. Okay, so I don't want to hear that. And over here, I've been having this frame. It is heavy as hell. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so it's there. So that's there. I really like this section. 
like to me my the kitchen part this is my favorite section right here because it just goes all well together and then i got this section over here okay i'm sorry i think um the camera just shut off so um let me just say this part real real quickly because i really want to make maybe a 20 minute video um so yeah like this is where i and in my my refrigerator i have all of my baggies all of my stuff like i'm the type that i ha i like to have everything in just one section and i'm i don't know i'm very organized because i like to know where all my stuff is at you know when i feel when you're organized you're more structured and you know where you can find your things at blah 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 so that's there let me see this is my freezer because I, I told my friend i was gonna give her a tour about everywhere so this is like um i did pre-made um burgers what i do is i make them i freeze them i put it in there now this freezer um i don't know if you notice i got like french fries cool wick my sofrito my ices um sometimes when i have bread i like to freeze them it, you know for it can last longer um i got pizzas and stuff i don't know if you notice it's really no meat the only meat that probably is here is the um the frozen um the frozen burgers because I make the burgers and I freeze them but there's like none of my meat is here I got a deep freezer in my pantry which I'm gonna show you so so this is the beef burger these are my turkey burgers um over here this section is all like breakfast stuff like this is bacon this is sausages pepperonis blah blah and then over here is my fish we got the bacalao we got the tilapia fish we got um whiting fish shrimp cooked shrimp so basically that's what it is <laughs> And then over here, don't judge my food <laughs> and everything like that. But this is my my refrigerator, and these are all my sauces. And these are meat because, of course, today I'm gonna make burgers. Right now, I'm about to make some nice ham with home fries and eggs. And I got chicken cutlets here that I'm gonna cut. Anyway, so um, I got here my limes, my my onions, my potatoes my eggs my my cheese that i want to one day make a video on that um these are just like my little biscuit section i got my butters there my cold cuts there um my sofrito my eggs my wine Shh. <laughs> so yeah and then over here this is what i really wanted to show my friend because she also wants tips on how to organize so um, i don't know if you notice i got three little plastic here you can buy this in the dollar tree um and these are my my all my veggies these are my peppers this right here got my broccoli and my um carrots and celery and such and let me put the cranberries away then i got here garlic all my strawberries and i wanted to also show her that um you see this is another good tip that when you got um let's say fresh parsley or or cilantro you know a lot of people they just buy it put it in the bag and it's already old within like two three days so what i do is i take paper towels i wrap it up i wet the paper towel first put it on the tip of the of the cilantro and um and it stays fresh like that for a while. Sometimes I'll be having it fresh for like two weeks. So that's what it is. Oh, wait a minute. There you go. All right, so that's my kitchen. Um, um, The refrigerator, how it looks. And these are like the sauces, like I said. And that's that. And then um, over here, I got here the cabinet, the way it's set up up there i got all my little plastics and then over here i got my coffee cups you know in case like in the morning if i got time i'll make coffee to go if not i'll buy coffee outside um i usually take stuff like this in like in mcdonald's and stuff like that because sometimes when i serve food i like to put like ketchup put it in the side in case you want ketchup if you don't um these are my coffee cups right there over here is my black dishes 
over here, I don't know if you noticed, this is like to make cocktails and like drinks and stuff. Well, except for this because this is like to make meatballs and stuff. But I have to like the little umbrellas and I got the little um straws to make drinks. And look, I want to show you this. And this is, I love this. This is like a domino, um, like domino sh stuff. And you see, this is like to put your drinks. This is number two, number six. Do not ask me where I got it from because my sister bought it for me as a gift. And I've had this for years, <laughs> years. And I don't even use it that much. So, okay, over here we got the shot cups. We got the drink cups. This is for when I put ice in there. You know, you got the little thing there. I got my little nice cups it says here life's too short to drink cheap liquor <laughs> so this is cute um and then i got here my cut cold knives i got the brillo there because you know i like to keep clean um this is um some of the stuff that i shaped to make the rice those other things that i use like when i'm doing the videos that i put it you know whatever so yeah i'm hope i'm giving her ted so i got the plastics on top of the uh, the cabinet that i just showed you and you know those are mines and this so now everybody always thinks this is a uh how you call it everybody always thinks that this is um the pantry no it ain't a pantry <laughs> all right this is and i'm gonna show you quickly this is the boiler <laughs> So let's close that up because I don't mess with that. The pantry is here. Now when I moved in here, that curtain did not come along with it. But I put it there to divide everything. So let's go to this real quickly. Let me turn off the light real quick. Okay, so we're here. And I'm not going to really go like like crazy explain everything to you. But anyway, um, these are like all my box. It's like kind of slanted because I got a lot of food here. <laughs> And stuff. So these are like um um like all the boxed boxed um food um as you can see I got cake mix I got macaroni ziti jello um oatmeal cornbread stuff you know and stuff. So that's what I got in that section. This is all of my spices that i got and yes i got a lot of them because i like to try different spices you never know when you see a recipe and it requires something so that's that and then i got here my baking goods <laughs> you know to bake cakes i got my little sprinkles and stuff to make cakes i'm not really a baker so but i you know I'll, I'll bake a cake or whatever or cupcakes or whatever for my kids but i'm not really a baker i like to cook food so over here we got the canned goods <clears throat> excuse me um the the vegetables and stuff like and you could see some of them is from shop right i buy i'll be buying cheap brands trust me and then over here i got here like um pineapple um sweet and condensed milk like you know cherry pie fillings that's that section right here mostly fruits and to make desserts and stuff if you gotta add it um cream of cocoa um and all that other stuff so and these are more like spices like barbecues and ketchups and and such and over here i got um a lot of gravies in that section um as you can see right there i got here spam and corns and like stuff like that my son loves spam if i make something that he doesn't like because he's a picky eater you know i'll cut a couple of slices with rice or like with something and he'll eat it i got there my tuna fish my chicken stuff and i got this spaghetti and meatballs i'm trying to tell you real quickly um i got here all like tomato stuff so um crushed tomatoes tomato paste um um spaghetti sauce anything that got to do with tomatoes i got there um tomato soups i got there all types of beans that and this is my kitchen like i said i don't have a lot of stuff 
and everything like that. And in case you're wondering about this door, this is because we're in the back of my house. My house is big. I'm not gonna go outside because it's kind of raining and stuff. And this is my porch, my balcony and stuff. So just, I live next to three churches. That's one of them. So that's that. So, um, sorry this video was really long. I just hope that my friend got to see the video because she's always like, why you never go and put in, like, let, let, um, show your kitchen when you're doing videos and stuff like that and everything. Or she asks me, why you never show yourself cooking it? I mean, come on, like, not every day I look pretty. You understand? And sometimes I'm here with my messy hair. You understand? Like, <laughs> you know, my hair in a bun. You know, I don't want to look like that in a video that's just the way i am and stuff i'm trying to look nice when i'm doing a video but besides that i'm just camera shy like i'll probably start laughing i'd rather be behind the camera and just showing you how to cook that's what it is and um i hope that at least not only making the video for her but i also hope that maybe i give gave somebody some tips on how to be more structured and more organized and stuff and maybe gave them like an idea like oh i should do that you know so that's just the way it is over here is the living room and one day i will do a video on my living room because you know it's really nice i got a lot of zebra stuff and you know maybe i could give somebody a few tips here and there and stuff so all right so let me start making my delicious ham sweet ham and um home fries and nice fried eggs um i'm gonna do a video on the home fries so check out for that video and um comment and subscribe and once again i'm sorry this video is long but you know how i am i like to to give everybody details of everything that I do. So have a good morning and stay inside because it's going to be raining all day. All right. God bless.